Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Fallout 4. Last time we got thoroughly thrashed by Deathclaw and uh, we're not going to go that way again. So what we're going to do is go out this door. I think that's the door we wanted to go through. Um, do I have room for any of this? I do. I know I already looted this room, but uh, I thought there was going to be more up top uh, other than just a alpha Deathclaw that was really going to, you know kick my shit in, so instead, there's, we can head to, yeah, let's head to the garage. I think this is the only other place I had to go to, I think the other door locked the roof, and I just really hope, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, that once I leave this building, the death claw doesn't jump down and chase me. I hope he stays stuck up there on the roof, like, I would very much appreciate that. Like, stay away, good sir. All across the United States, in the aftermath of the Great War, the bottle caps of Nuka-Cola are the most commonly used currency. I'm glad they give me something to read while we wait, I don't know, a solid 35 seconds to get back into the goddamn game. It's just a garage. Load it. Come on, man. I don't want to look at these mole rats any longer. I realized I'm a little not in my usual position with the mic, so let me readjust that quick. Oh, good. I can't see. Sh really? That's how... That's how dark it is. That's... That sucks. So, we still have... Hey. Well. Okay, well, McCready, you don't need that. that anymore. Well, I wonder. Actually, if he has that. Nope, it looks like he used missiles. I think. Because I think I, I thought I gave him four. So we're going to take that back. You don't need that. But we are going to see what's down here. <laughs> that is the wrong button for vats. Hello? Oh, is that just... Is that a super mutant? God, I don't want to fight super mutants. That never goes well. Well, shit. Oh, got a ghoul. Brady. That doesn't do much to him. Let's go see what we got going on over here. Probably a bunch more of them. Oh, good. Why didn't I get him first? Go, 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 go. Get me the Protectron. They can't touch me. I'm frozen in time. I'm hacking frozen in time. Uh, my name is Wish. It's not Wish. It's Arms. It's not arms. Uh, there was one that was right here. Was it not right there? I thought I just saw a move. Oh, there it is. Tries reset. Perfect. So, I did wish in arms. Let's do busy. Uh, most. Okay. So, I'm assuming S is correct. No, S can't be right. So it's not S, but one is correct. So it's the O. So then for arms, one is correct, which means it can't... It must be gods. Really? It's home? No, it can't be, because arms. I'm missing one. So I guess we're just gonna... I don't understand what I'm reading. Because it's saying the likeness in arms, but nothing... Oh, the M. God, why am I like this? Through. I forgot that, uh, you know, the English language is a thing. And that it sucks. How do you stay over there with this mongrel? Oh, is that it? I thought more than mongrels were popping up here. Alright, that's fine. I'll take their meat and sell it to somebody. Okay, there's another one. Uh, headshot. And a crit. Take him out. 
because he has the skull, doesn't that mean he's going to mutate as a legendary? Or does that mean he specifically, does he have to specifically be a legendary for that? I forget. I don't remember much. Uh, I guess he, you have to specifically have a legendary in your name to mutate and come back with a second version. Well, that works well for me because I didn't have to deal with it. Can I? No, I can't. Alright, good talk. I can't do shit. I can't do shit in Fallout 4. It's like they won't let you... Oh, they killed some people. Postman uniform, that's cool. Um, so yeah, I don't even remember what the hell we were doing. I don't remember anything about any of that. Uh, let's, let's see. And there's the elevator. So yeah, with on that note, let's. what mission did I have queued up? Oh yeah, wasn't it the Cabot House? Wasn't I trying to take us to the Cabot House? Yeah, Jack Cabot. Let's, uh... Let's just run through here. Nope. It's nothing. Don't don't mind me. Don't don't worry about it. Just it's fine. Man, this city's a shit show. I mean, like we already knew that, but like this is ridiculous. So I wonder why it's got two different markers for me to go to for the Cabot House. I thought the Cabot House was in the middle of nowhere. Please tell me you're a friend. This is private property. Okay. Ooh. Wow. Huh? Yeah, I thought the Cabot House was in the middle of nowhere. I didn't think it was in the middle of the city. What am I thinking of then? 1711. No, no way. Oh. Uh, I'm expecting. Let me in. Edward Deegan asked me to come here. Oh, it's you. Good. Come on in. Okay. Well, is that Edward Deegan? Did he just like what? Or is there multiple ghouls? Or does this man just have a super rough voice? Come on. Let's go meet the boss. Sounds good. Yeah, that's Deegan right there. Oh. How is this place untouched? Jack, the new guy is here. One moment, one moment. I just have to... Oh, good. He's insane. He'll be right with us. <laughs> oh, damn. Clearly, I'll need to adjust the mixture. Hello, hello. Welcome to Cabot House. I'm Jack Cabot. Okay. Can I talk to you? Pleased there we to go. meet you, Jack. And I am very pleased to meet you. Edward finds it tiresome. But I always like to know personally everyone who works for me. Please, have a seat. How about a drink? I... Edward, the good bourbon, eh? I... Please, have a seat. Whoever lives here must have made a okay. deal with the devil. Okay, um... Where do you want me to now, sit? Before we get down to business... I have a question I like to ask all my new employees. Is this really the time Don't for... interrupt, Edward. The question is this. Do you believe there is other intelligent life in the universe? Yeah. The universe is a big place. Anything could be out there. Wonderful. Most people's minds are too narrow to admit the possibilities of an infinite universe. But I'm not talking about flying saucers and little green men. I'm talking about the hidden history of our planet. The very origins of human civilization. Ancient powers that modern science, even at its pinnacle, could barely begin to comprehend. Okay. Interesting. That's really interesting. Look, I know I talk a lot of crap, but this alien stuff kind of freaks me out. I'm glad really? You say that. It's become my really, life's McCready. work. My approach is to combine a rigorous scientific method while keeping an absolutely open mind. So much has been closed off to us simply because people assumed they already knew the answers. My father excavated a city in the Rub al Khali in Arabia, which he dated to more than 4,000 years before the rise of any known human civilization. The structures and artifacts were strange, disturbing, even. 
clearly not constructed for or by humans. I've spent my life trying to decipher what he uncovered. Jack, can I tell him what I need him to do? I'm sorry, Edward. I just get carried away sometimes. Wait, his dad Sending excavated that? The missing ship After the bombs yeah. fell? Well then, I'd better leave you to it. We'll talk more about this some other time. How old are you? Are less rushed, it isn't important now. Welcome to the family. Okay, you're officially hired. Congratulations. I'm ready to get to work. Good. That's part of the job, by the right, way. Right, a little bit of the. It's best to keep a little bit of lag mind. there. That wasn't too fun. Jack may be eccentric, but he's definitely not crazy. The job I got for you is simple. Jack owns a facility north of the city. There's an important package that went missing between there and here. I need you to track it down and bring it back to me. Any questions? Um. Lots. Only about a million. You should start at Parsons State Insane Asylum. Oh, Don't good. Let the name spook you. It's just a secure building that we're using. We think the courier got ambushed as he was leaving the place. The guards heard gunfire in the distance, but we don't know exactly what happened. Check in with Maria at Parsons. She's Ambush. in charge of the security force there. She can point you in the right direction. You all set then? Uh, sure. Yep. I'll see you soon with the package. Good luck. Don't get killed on your first job. So why is there a bit of lag when it's on me and McCready? Hey, need something? So I know not to. Savings Bank of McCready, open for business. That's not actually what I wanted to do. My bad. Um, let's drop this. Let's turn off the light hey. and let's talk. Ammo. ammo. Your thoughts? The open road and a loaded weapon. Doesn't get much better than this. You've got a thick chest plate. How do you feel about us? I don't really know how we're doing. I guess I need more time to decide. That's fine. Just don't do alien Kill stuff with you. Trick. Got it. Come to think of it, I have. Uh -huh. Your thoughts? Play your cards right, and we stand to make a whole lot of money. What are your thoughts on our relationship? I think we'd get along better if you started listening to me once in a while. Well, you... You didn't... Nothing okay. Nothing else I needed. I met me. Okay, got it. Understandable. So don't do the Jack Cabot missions with him. He doesn't look... I was locked in here until he gave me the key. What if he didn't like me? Would they have just killed me? And also, back to his dad. He said his dad uncovered stuff? Aren't we in the U.S.? Like, did he get the Brotherhood of Steel to fund him to go over there? Actually, that makes a lot of sense. The Brotherhood of the Steel is constantly about uh, finding new technology. So... Okay, that was loud as hell. I was not prepared for that at all. Um, okay, not gonna do the Jack Cabot mission right now, so we came out here for no reason. Let's... We don't want to go to the chem lab just yet. But let's see. Are we close to the Zephyr Ridge camp now? No, I will never be close to the Zephyr Ridge camp. I'm sorry. What the fuck? Oh, they want me to go to the Insane Asylum. That's all the way up there. So, okay, that's how they're making me fill out the map. Is just slowly give me missions in that general direction. Alright. Understandable. Got it. Uh, so we're going to take out the out and left field. Oh, no, we want to keep the out and left field, but remove the quarter mastery. And then we want to... Shit. I need to click into miscellaneous? Um, the mutated fern flower for Solomon. I'm sorry, the what? Can I remove that? Place marker. Oh, remove marker. There we go. Perfect. Uh, so we've got something there, and then something over there by the Forest Grove Marsh. Well, I think we've done quite a bit. Uh, and by that, I mean absolutely nothing. So what we're going to do instead is go to the Diamond City Markets and drop the... It's been saying that this entire time, but where is their enemy... Uh, no. Come on, McCready. Let's, let's have the sentry bot take care of that. I like how they, like, end it right here, though. So, like, if a super mutant walks, like, here, are they gonna care? 
I do find that interesting though, like, if this is a perfectly maintained house, like, how? Like, what kind of money? What kind of funding does that dude get? Or, like, obviously they were rich, but very apparent with that kind of house in this kind of city. Shit. Well. Uh, I can't say I'm a fan of this. Uh, at all. Uh, let's just, um... Shit. Punch it. Punch it. Oh, wow. That actually does a lot of damage. I was not prepared for that. Come on, man. I want to hit you with some shotgun. Oh, McCready got him. Nice. Good job, McCready. I like you. You actually do work. I didn't realize I killed one. Am I losing my mind? Did I kill one with the laser rifle? I thought I... Hmm. I thought I switched to the shotgun before I killed any. That's a nice little looking boat over there. But now we're going to head to the Diamond City Markets. And let's return that bat to our friend. Uh, the syringer is a rare custom-made weapon that can shoot modified medical syringes at an enemy who then suffers the effects of whatever chemicals in the syringe. That sounds awesome, especially if there's one that says, like, just rage out, just roid out and attack all your friends. Go crazy. Do that. That'll be cool as hell. Laser rifles and pistols uh, do damage or something. I'll tell you, nothing's changed. Okay. Uh, it's a nice, lovely iBot. We got a resident. We've got the Noodle Boy. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, the Swatter guy. Hey, it's you. You find any of those baseball items I mentioned? Uh, yeah. I like your gumption. Let me take a look. This baseball. It's the real deal. You'd sign one of these and give it to the children of anyone you killed on the field. That's right. He has no idea what's happening. Look at that card. See those numbers on the back? Tracks the count of enemies beaten to death by the player. Check out the leather on that mitt. Ah, really good players use them to catch bullets. True fact there. That's everything on the list. <laughs> Thank you. Far as I'm concerned, you're now a part of baseball collector history. I don't remember getting them. But was that it? Hey, Mo. Remember, swatters will win you the game. The game of beating people up, that is. I mean, I guess that's the game we're gonna have. Uh, what, what do you, you have? Baseball history. Right here. Is this your whole shop? Oh. Okay. Um. It does only weigh three. Should I keep that as my melee weapon? That actually would be kind of cool. Yeah, I'll get a. I'll wear the full baseball uniform and everything. That would actually be kind of funny. He's got some 308 rounds. I think I actually am going to get the Rockville Slugger. Just because it's a specialty weapon. Just because I, sh I want to. I think I already have a missile launcher back. No, I have a fat man. I don't think I just have a missile launcher. So I'm going to keep that until I go back to Sanctuary and figure out what we got going on there. Sell the dog collar. Is that all I got? Uh, oh, drugs buff out. Cloning fungus. Keep the carrot, but sell the dog meat. You get a lot of money for that dog meat. Uh, Rad X right away. Keep those. Tarberry and Tato's. Anything here? Yeah, the folders. I don't need those. And miscellaneous. Hmm. Anything that weighs anything? Yes. Oh, just the overdue books. We'll hold on to those. Burnt books. I don't know why I have those. Burnt magazines. Sure. I don't want those. Uh, and then all my junk, I need that to make stuff. So I guess we're going to call that there. Cool. I bought some stuff off him. I did that. So thank you, Mo. Uh, in this episode, we made it to the Cabot House after killing some people. We... Okay. We then, uh, you know, I don't went know out, we almost got ambushed by... I'm trying to talk. One or two people, and everyone forgets he's a freaking sin. That's racist. Protection for sale. Uh, so, Gold yeah, pretty much. Said. See you guys in the next episode. Uh, I don't know what we're going to do. We'll, uh... We'll work on some more side quests. That, that's what we're going to end up doing. 